Welcome back, chaps, to some more Dragon Quest. I'm wearing the regular outfit again, just for a change, because we've been wearing the other one for, it feels like, forever. So it was time for a change, and speaking of change, the reserves have changed. Not as drastically as I thought. I've actually only made two new critters, and these are them right here. Now, as you can see, we've made the Archdemon. Um, no real reason other than, well, two reasons, I guess. One, I'm just a big fan of these guys. I think it's probably their little green boots. <laughs> I just really like them. Uh, he's, um, he's got some interesting traits, actually. I think, yes, he's come with Bangmeister, and he's gonna learn Ultra Crafty Banger. Uh, which I'm told might, I'm told might actually help against metal enemies. I'm not too sure. I'll have to test that out myself, but, um, pretty good traits, pretty good. Uh, considering he's, he's gonna learn Kaboomal, which is fantastic, and a bunch of other abilities as well. Uh, I'm gonna go through the talent points in a second. Um, but yeah, we made him with Flappy, Flappy Chappy, who I kind of wasn't really using, and, uh, the Hocus Poker, which we got last time. So, there we go, that's Archdemon. If anyone wants to be named after, or, or have the Archdemon named after them, feel free to ask. And I've made a dark saber cat, which I have called Zelif, which you may notice is Felix backwards, because he's the dark representation, he's the mirror image, the evil twin of Felix. And uh, yeah, I kind of just made him just because I really like dark saber cats. However, he is also going to have some interesting abilities, um, mostly uh, a lot of debuffs and, yeah, Kazamel and Grim Breath, which sound very nice indeed. Uh, Zam Ward, Black Breath, which we've already had, of course, Kadim, um, and it, uh, some of his other skill trees have some pretty nice stuff as well, like Kanum, Katox, Thwack, uh, Ultra Antioxidant, Ultra Fidget, so... Yeah, and Kasap, which would be nice to have on the team too. Uh, what else does he got? And then just MP, because I think I think he's going to be more of the magic cat, the magic kitty, as opposed to Felix, who's more of a physical kitty. And I kind of like, I, I kind of like that idea. So we we may use him, we may not, but he, he comes with some pretty cool traits again, probably very similar to what Felix has, to be honest. Uh, let's have a quick look. Da -da -da. Yeah, kind of got instant acceleration. Uh, although, funnily enough, saying that uh, Zelif is going to be the more uh, magic kitty it actually comes with Rando Umph. So, anyway, doesn't really matter. I'm sure it'll be good once we get him leveled. And uh, what did I use to make you, actually? Oh, yeah, the Hypothermian and the uh, Super Good, whatever it was called. Uh, that we got from the golden monster egg last time. So hopefully I'll get another one, because, yeah, the tiger gram. Absolutely used in so many recipes, it was unreal. Uh, I could have made a large monster out of it, I suppose, but um, I'm pretty happy with these. We'll get them leveled. Still got the liquid metal slime and the phantom swordsman. And, of course, the main team is untouched, because it really doesn't need to be right now. I think the only time I'm going to change this up is if I come across a huge difficulty spike. Or, I just fancy it. Like I say, I might swap in a few of these into the main team occasionally. We'll see how we how we get on, but I'm pretty happy with things as they stand. Uh, so, yeah, I don't think we're going to be doing any synthing now. Let's go and see if we can explore the Circle of Indulgence upper echelon. Which, uh, might as well just run up the stairs. Now, I'm a little bit pressed for time today. Uh, not because, well, I do have some things going on later, but my control is low on battery, so why do I keep smashing these pots? So if the video, if, if, if the controller dies, then that's just going to be the end of the video, basically. So we'll see how far we can get in, um, big fuck off cake land. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've made so many diabetes jokes in this playthrough. Just, just in this uh, circle of Nadiria, uh, I'm, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm all out. I have nothing else to add. This, <laughs> you know what I mean? Nothing else to add to the mix, you could say, the cake mix. Uh, right. So let's get a move on. Let's see what uh, critters we can find. Of course, I always check behind the tower, but uh, there's never anything here. Absolutely bugger all. Although, oh, look at that! 
Hey, that's cool. That's cool. I don't I don't know why you would do that. There's nothing up there. But uh Okay, I'm just really? Did you not put us a chest on that platform, game developers? Be the perfect place to do it. Uh, I'm just trying to see if I can spot any chests from all the way up here before I take the plunge. This place looks bloody massive. As has pretty much uh, every recent area. But we'll get cracking. We'll get we'll get down this. Where am I going? Where should I jump down? Also, oh, the music stopped. Oh, uh, it's quite peaceful though. Uh, I don't know where to. Is there a safer way down than just yeeting myself off into the abyss? I guess we're just gonna go this way and land on a shoe. Huh, that's called landing on your feet. Okay, <laughs> get it? Oh, reflecting spells, midnight sneakers. We've already seen you, chaps. We've already seen you, chaps. Uh, but yeah, I've done nothing else off screen just since those two monsters, so... Yeah, we're all good. Hopefully, I'd like to at least get to the dungeon of this, uh... Of this area today. And, uh, if we come across any more blooming King Metal Slimes, I'd be very happy. There we go, already level 11 for our newbies. Oh, and I did say I would spend the talent points, didn't I? I did say I would do that. Not that I'm going to be using them right now, but, um... Yeah, I think we'll get Storm Chaser... ...nearly maxed out. Oh, so close, so close. Really hoping Kaboom will do a lot of damage once this guy's leveled up. Uh, and then we've got Strong Speller, so we can get Kazapple... Kazing, I guess? Having another healer might be nice? Uh, cast Slasher might be more of a thing I go for next. Uh, and... Yep, Evil Genius, we've seen these. Alright, you bloiter. Nearly got Grim Breath. Good stuff. Uh, Mr. Slime, you've got some points as well. Nothing for you, though. And Mr. Pig... Nothing for you, either. Okay. Oh, God, I really just want... I really want uh, a Swiss roll now. Hey, chest. Another mini medal, all right. I think we need maybe two more of those now. Sod off. Uh, we got mummies. These, oh, you, you shit. You little winged bastard. I've got all of you. These are all, these aren't new monsters. Come on, game. These aren't new. I want brand spanking new shiny monsters that I can fuse together against their will. Oh, ho, ho, level 60 for Mr. Pig. Jeez, another 10 HP as well. Nice. Yeah, honestly, I was worried about, you know, synthing and, and the, these high-level monsters and starting from level 1 again, but I bet, again, if I found a, another... Another uh, King Metal Slime, I mean, they'd be caught up in no time. They really would. It's just, you know, whether or not I'm lucky enough to either find one or kill it. Um, wait. Oh, that's another one. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we've seen all of these. Uh, so I'm kind of going to ignore them for now, because I'm pretty sure. Okay, just, yep, yep, yeet, yeet yourself off. Uh... Oh, and again, they follow me. They follow me. Uh, oh, I haven't got any of these. Chocolate Wisps and Behemoth Slime. Yeah, we've seen them before, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Uh, let's see, can I scout? Oh, I didn't check the paddock today either. Should have checked the paddock. Uh, we'll go for the Behemoth. Thirty percent ain't bad. Bollocks. Ha ha! Da, 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 don't you dare! Right, scouts. Get one more try. Yeah. Yay! 
I am getting really lucky. <laughs> <laughs> These last couple of videos, the luck is back. Bashimoth Slime, you are very welcome to go straight to the paddock. Uh, you come with the Hulk talent, okay. She-Hulk? I could call it She-Hulk. Never did watch, uh, never did watch that. I've, I've not watched many Marvel things recently. Uh, let's see. I don't know where I'm going here. Uh, well, I'm not gonna be getting over that. I need to find a bridge or something. Uh, let's check the map. So, I do need to get across there. There is a bridge this way. So, let's head over in that general direction, in the eerie quiet of no music land. And see if there's any chests over here as well. I, oh, maybe that's how I would have gotten down properly. Yeah, maybe that's... Maybe that's the way I should have gone. Doesn't matter. Alright, let's go over this bridge. What's this bridge made of? More cho white chocolate, dark chocolate. Oh, sh that's a lot of... Uh, that's a lot of chocolate wisps. Oh. They don't notice me. How do they not notice me? Right, I'm just going to scout them. I'm not going to even bother using meat on them. Because who wants to mix chocolate and meat? Right? That just doesn't sound good to me. Like, you're not supposed to put... You're definitely not supposed to put beef in trifle, for example. Um, that didn't work, did it? Okay, great. Just kill him. Is there any instance of chocolate and meat going well together? You guys, let me know. It doesn't sound too appealing to me, and I don't know if I've ever tried it. Da -da -da. Tend to kill level 55. Got you some talent points, and oh, hey, that was pretty lucky. You can absolutely join my team, you delicious looking bastard. Da -da -da. Okay, in you go. Oh, he, he, he's got the Majin Buu face. He totally has the Majin Buu face. Uh, I might want to call you Buu now. That's too late. It's too late. Uh, you rank E. Straight to the paddock. Depot, whatever. And I feel like we still have a ways to go. Just checking to see if any hidden goodies around. Uh, with how, like, cluttered this place is, it's actually quite hard to see where the, uh, where the intended path is. Have I scouted you before? The Sasquatch, Sasquatch with, like, the cinnamon pouring out of it, or the honey, or whatever. Saccharine Sasquatch. I haven't. I haven't scouted you. Yeah. Dude. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, chap. Sorry. Saccharine sacks. I like that, actually. That's perfect. That's perfect. Okay. <laughs> Good old sacks. Alright. Nothing down there, I don't think. Oh, there's a chest there, but we won't be able to get that right now. Again, I could use some seasoning, I suppose. Should we do that? I have been missing a lot of chests lately. Uh, let's do it. Maybe winter will be the one that we need. Uh, okay. I think we can get to that now. Yep, there we go. And an elfin elixir. Definitely useful. Right. Oh, God. Yeah, getting around in winter can be a lot easier. Uh, we've just skipped a bunch of... Wait, are you an N... You're not an NPC. What's this on the... No, never mind. I'm, uh, ignore me. Ignore me. <laughs> the way he runs. Ignore me. Alright, how do we get up on this cake, then? How do we get up on this cake? We're right near it. We're right near the, uh... 
the gateway, but I feel like we're gonna have to go the long way around, probably. Yeah, I have a feeling. Ooh, hello! Have I scouted one of you before? I can't remember. I don't think I have. No, I haven't. Right, definitely gonna use meat on you. Dun, dun, dun. I bet these are used in a good recipe. Not just because the, you know, a very sweet little treat. Son of a bitch. Do, do, do. Uh, try again. Come on. Come on. Ooh, only 15%. Nah, that, that was never happening. Okay. They're actually hitting pretty hard as well. Oh, probably because my defense is down, or at least it was on some of them. Oh, my dog's walking into the room. Hi, Max. Thanks for joining me. You'd eat the shit out of those slimes, wouldn't you, buddy? Got a bit of a sweet tooth. All right, they're already up to level 17. Pump a bonus ball wears off. Must remember to pop that back on. Uh, yeah, so I'll probably try and scout one of those off screen as well, maybe. In fact, we'll give it one more try. We'll give it one more try. Uh, oh, we haven't got a noble gas baggin. Ah. Okay, this actually could be pretty tough if we don't get them scouted straight away. Because they do hit pretty hard. Let's uh, Here. see if we can. Now. Yeah, really low odds on them. Oh, angry straight away. Do 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 do. Yep. Time to murder them. They need to die. Oh, I'll tell you what, Felix is doing some good damage, man. Even with fairly, I mean, it says that, like, Bright Splitter isn't that good. It's, uh, it's putting in the work. And Felix, welcome to level 59. Six more attack and talent points, as if you needed them. Uh, yeah, I think this might be the way we're supposed to go. There's so much more we could explore, though. It's insane. What on earth are you? What on earth are you? What? What even is this? Uh, it's a mangle claw. Okay. I've definitely never seen you before. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen that kind of monster before. Unless my memory's failing me, which it very well could be. I want one. That is so weird. Oh, and 35%. Uh. Yeah, those, those blooming creme carrot slimes hit really hard. Now. Yes, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Mango claw. Makes me think of the Mangle Grove. Right, you're rank D. I have never seen you before, ever, in my whole life. Cold Snapper. Right, well, again, you go into the depot. Hmm, interesting. Well, that was good. At least we've seen a new monster now. Completely new monster, I mean. Not just a palette swap. Right, uh... I've jumped off there now. How do I get back up? Uh, maybe this way... Maybe this oh maybe this is actually the way to go. I don't know. There there is so much we could have been exploring here. I see a see a chest over there as well. Oh, and there's one here too. And another one of you guys. Oh, it's a bloody why do I always fall for that? There are no green chests, I swear. Why do I always fall for that? Oh, just kill him. Just kill him. So uh yeah, I, uh, thanks to all of you who are still watching this playthrough. Hope you're enjoying it. We've still got a ways to go. 
We've still definitely got a ways to go, but I am currently kind of prioritizing this, so... We'll, uh, we'll get through it, hopefully, I'd say within the next month. That's my plan, anyway. We'll see if that actually happens, because invariably with me, things pop up. Either I get sick or something else happens, but uh, I am feeling a little bit better, actually, than I have been recently, so... I'm gonna take that as a win. I need I need that win, guys. Uh, I am genuinely perplexed as to how to get over there. Let's have a look at the map again. But oh, I love me some Battenberg. Oh my god, I love and uh, that's the name of the town. I love it. Uh, there is there is a bridge from that pl right. I see. I see. We're actually very close. Oh look, we can get we can get flutter slimes here. I've just realised. Hey, that's nifty. Oh, sod off. I didn't actually want to fight you. I was just happy that I could. I've already got I've already got an amazing version of you. You are not needed. Oh damn. <laughs> Denied. Yeah, we're just gonna trounce everything now. I think the boss fights could still be a bit tough depending on what we're actually fighting. Again, ailments are a problem, but uh, level-wise, I mean, we must be so far ahead of the curve now. And, uh, yeah, keep an eye out for any more metal slimes, because I'm sure we can encounter them here as well. Uh, can I just squeeze past you, buddy? Thank you. Ah, there's there's the bridge. Oh, God. Oh, God. Uh, yes. Oh, no. Oh, it's it. Okay, it's a king slick slime. Now we could have we could have made you. We could have made you. We're not we're not at full health, but we're okay. So let's see how we do here. I might might just throw some meat at you just in case, because it would be cool to scout you. But the chances are pretty slim. Or should I use some manky meat? Because that could poison. That would poison. You know what? We're gonna try and poison it. Although. It's probably immune to poison. It's a king slick slime. It's probably completely immune. Didn't say it was though. Uh, we'll give it a try. We'll give it a try. Oh, he's not bothered. We did stun him though. We stunned the crap out of him. Ooh, not doing much damage though. Not doing much damage. Oh my god! Stun lock for the win. Yeah, this is where we need Kasap. This is why... Oh, we've prevented him from using spells as well. Uh, I can use Breath, though, which mostly misses uh, Paralyzed Felix. Oh, he is hitting hard. This could be a long fight. If, if the last big monster that we fought is anything to go by, this guy is going to be pre a bit of a slog. Um... Should I just kill the paralysis? I really need to go buy more items. I keep on forgetting to do that. I have lots of uh, panaceas, though. And moonwalk bulbs. Yeah, let's do that. There you go, buddy. Always frenzied. Oh, shit. Ow! Not... Okay, good, good. It prevented him from using Kefrizzle. We are not doing much damage here at all. Probably because he's frenzied. Oh, you sod. Spells prevented, bitch. Oh, shit. He just killed Tentakill. No. Yeah, we're not winning this one, chaps. I don't think we're winning this one. I mean, a part of me wants to see if we can pull this back. I mean, should we just, you know what, let's, let's put Mr. Slime in, instead of, uh, I think we need a healer still. I think temporarily, we'll swap out Felix, we'll swap in Archdemon as well, um, and we'll see if we can revive Tentacle. This is probably a very bad idea, because they are very, very weak. I did nothing. 
And he nearly killed Arnie. And Arnie is dead. And Archdemon somehow survives. Why isn't it using- oh, because I've not got it on healing. I should have- I should have given it orders. Archdemon, Kazing. Oh, you haven't learned Kazing yet! I'm an idiot! I'm an idiot. You know what? We're running. We're running. Sorry, chaps. That was going very poorly. <laughs> but, uh... At least, again, that kind of shows that even with our team being so powerful, there are still things out there that can give us a real run for our money. Uh, oh, can I not do a handy heal? Are you shitting me? Have I found any... Uh... Fast travel points? Desert Isle. Yeah, we have, but it's quite a ways away. It's quite a ways away, so I think... I'm just gonna use... Uh... And it just... Oh, I've only got one left, though. I've only got one left! Right, hang on. We're gonna change the party. Basically, I'm just gonna run through this area until I find a fast travel point. And then I'm gonna get back to, uh... To the tower and heal up. So, Phantom Swordsman, you're gonna join the team for now. Uh... Yeah. Oh. Uh... No. Confirm. Okay, right, let's see. I mean, we've, we've nearly... We're nearly there, I think. We just gotta climb the cake. Oh, in fact... Ah. We've made it. Have we seriously made it? Well, hang on. I bet there's... No. Let's just get this fast travel point. We can explore the rest of this area some other time. All right, we've made it to Battenberg. We've made it. Okay, this place looks wonderful. <laughs> I really want some Battenberg now. We actually had some the other the other day. It's one of my favorite cakes. Right, we need to go back to the tower, uh, heal up. So I'll just join you guys back here. Okay, fully healed, and now we can properly attempt this place. Uh, I went back to the paddock, got a few seeds or super seeds of magic. I think it was. So that's pretty nice, and again, I know I should be using these, um, especially considering at the moment I have been using some of these monsters for a while now, and I also don't really foresee me changing them, but uh, I just don't know. I just don't- I have so many seeds. So many seeds. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Right, we've got uh, teleporter here. Uh, that's not actually a door. Okay. Uh... Got some imps, which we've probably scouted, I'm guessing. Yep, and the sugar baddies as well, which still might be one of my, yeah, definitely one of my favorite names in this game. Uh, at least, because I think this is the first time I've seen those. Right, just kill them. Just kill them. We probably will be avoiding most fights in here, though, because we don't really need the XP. I really don't think we need it. I mean, some of my monsters do in the reserves, but, uh, that's fine. Zelif, level 21. Let's see, anything hiding behind these wafers? No. Mmm, this is so delicious. Oh my god. Right, how big is this place? Flan for you. Okay. Yeah, it's gonna be a big old dungeon. Wow! Oh my god, it is just like a giant hotel or something. It, rem you know what? It it's weirdly, it reminds me of the Grand Budapest Hotel. <laughs> I don't know why. It really, I don't know. A great film, by the way. One of my favorites. Uh, right, I really would like to... Oh, I technically don't have these either, the flying saucers. Well, I, I wanna, I wanna scout... I wanna scout this guy. Yeah. Again, probably should be using meats, really. If I keep on bloody forgetting to buy more. Then again, I don't think we can buy the really good meat, anyway. Son of a bitch. 
Mr. Pig's asleep. Tentacle's asleep. Arnie's confused. Definitely noticing a little bit of uh, a difficulty spike here, but if we hadn't killed that King Metal Slime, we might be struggling a bit more. Probably not too much, but... Uh, oh, our um, bumper ball's worn off. I should probably pop another one of those. Because why not? I've still got, like, four of them, I think. Yeah, why the heck not? That's a hundred fights, basically, of bonus XP. Which is nuts. And as we saw, you only need one of those fights to be a King Metal Slime, and you're, you're golden. There's a chest over there. I'm going for it. I'm going for it. You can't stop me. Mega Medicine? Very nice. Ah, son of a bitch. Well, oh, they don't notice my presence. Right, well, that's a free scout attempt, basically. Let's go for... Uh, a Meaty Treat. Here. Now. And yeah, sorry, I'm, I'm kind of sticking with speed-up mode a lot. It's just... Uh, I quite like it, to be honest. Uh, that didn't work. Yeah, we, still, we really don't have much chance here, do we? I think we probably have more chance of bloody just killing him. And seeing, uh, seeing if they join us. Yeah, I'm really impressed with Felix. Felix's damage output is bloody good. Da -da -da. Right. I think this is the only way we can go. Yeah. So do we go right or left? I don't... I don't know. We'll go left. Oh. Just dodged. Just dodged. There's got to be something hiding in one of these rooms, right? Are they... <laughs> Are they doing some training? There's nothing here? Oh, dude. That's okay. That's okay. Right, there's got to be some... Yeah, there we go. What a very weird layout. Three seeds of resilience. They're going to stay in my inventory for a while. Whoa, whoa. <sighs> That's okay. That's okay. It's all XP. I'm probably, again, not going to show many more of these fights. But bloody hell, they're over so quick. Yeah, it's going gonna, it's gonna to take a little while for the monsters to catch up to me if I don't get a Metal Slime killed, but... I think I'm, I think I'm okay. Oh, I th is this the prison? How do I get to that chest? This is so cute. I've just noticed, like, the coat of arms and everything. That's... Oh. How on earth do we get that chest open? Oh, hello, sneaky pots. Oh, just a big... I mean, to be fair, that's probably normal. Yep, a prisoner... You know, when nature calls. Uh. Ah, uh, ha, 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 ha. Very sneaky. Oh, nothing. Oh, you sod. Dun, dun, dun. Magic water. Right, what do we get? What do we get? A charmer's scroll. Well, I. I think I've, I was born with that. <laughs> no. Right, well that's, uh, yeah, I think that's a dead end then. So, let's go... Back the other way. Oh, just avoided him then. This this dungeon is a delight. Not only because it looks absolutely mouth-watering, but uh, just very clever. I like it. They had some fun with this game. It may not be the best-looking game, you know, it may not have the best story in my opinion, but gosh darn, it is just fun, and 
as with all Dragon Quest games, utterly charming. Please be a mini medal. All right, another mini medal. Said that differently, doesn't matter. I think we're very close to our next reward. If not already there, I don't know, we'll have to check. Can't remember how many I've got. Right, I think we found the uh, sleeping quarters, these beds, man. What are they even made of? Like gummies? Are they like gummy? They look like gummy toes or hands. They look actually like they would feel weird. Because there's like a shine to them. I don't know if I'd like to sleep on those. Maybe they're like water beds. I have no idea. Uh, is there anything hidden in any of them? No. Doesn't look like it. Uh, this is the, uh, the uh, dining room. Where one of them is fast asleep. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. I think we found the stairs, though, Neely. Okay, tend to kill level 56, 13 HP. Good gosh, Phantom Sword's been up to 51 as well. I mean, he could very well take a spot on the main team. He is strong enough, I think. But uh, I, I like the setup that I've got going. That's a bloody can of box. Not even going to bother going over there. That is totally a can of box. Right, up to... Oh, hello. Up to the second floor. I love these stairs. I'm surprised my controller hasn't beeped to tell me that it's uh, about to die. Because I'm pretty sure it is. Alright, you guys can sod off. I'm just checking this room before I leave. Doesn't seem to be anything, though. Which is a shame. No, that's fine. Right, let's have a look at this floor, shall we? So we're going back out to the foyer, although we'll be on, obviously, the first floor up. Just gotta check behind these wafers. It makes searching for chests a lot harder. Because <laughs> when you're in, in, in them, there's not really much room to maneuver. Man, I got bloody ambushed, didn't I? Oh no, three of us are confused, I'm running. Screw that. I ain't got no time for that. You kidding me? Ain't nobody got time for that. God, is that, is that like, how old is that meme now? How old is that? Is that, is that really old now? Oh god, I'm so old. Ooh, I don't know how I dodged you. Uh, okay, we got more stairs going down here. So I'm, I'm gonna quickly check where this leads. Ah, just a, its own little room with... Okay, two regular chests, two phonies. Great big phonies. So I'm gonna ignore them. Which is, uh, brooch. And a phoenix filch... filtra? Filter? Anything else down here? Nope. Okay, you can sort off. Go fork yourself. Go fork yourself. Right, let's have a look. What did we just get? Two accessories for one thing. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, that gives you cast cutter. That's actually pretty good. I was looking at the stats and was like, only 10, 10 plus MP. That ain't the best. I don't know if that would uh, stack with other, it, like if you already have that trait. I don't know if that would stack, but um, that's kind of cool. Also, around here, I mean, of clarity would be good as well. We are getting confused a lot and put to sleep a lot. Um, and I do have another rousing ring. The rousing ring's really bloody good. 40 defense and insomniac. Uh, what was the other one I got? Uh... Wait, what did I get? I got the... Oh, the witch's brooch. What else did I get? I've completely forgotten what was the other thing I just picked up. What did I just pick up? I don't think it was an accessory, was it? What did I get? Oh, I don't even remember. Oh, uh, whatever. <laughs> Hopefully it wasn't very good. <laughs> Uh, I thought I got two accessories then. I have no idea. I have no idea. I'll have to look back in Edison. It's fine. 
Um, yeah, I am tempted actually to give a rousing ring to someone else. Because, yeah, I mean, sweet breath. It's very annoying, and these enemies do use it a lot. Also, I think we need to bloody heal. There we go. Yeah, should I just... I mean, I really should give accessories to these monsters if they get called into action, especially Phantom Swordsman, so I'm going to give you the Rousing Ring. Yeah, because your defense kind of sucks anyway, so I'll give you that. Yes, fine. Right, let's keep going this way, I suppose. Back out to the foyer. I love this. This is bloody awesome. Best dungeon so far, just on purely aesthetics. Uh, oh, hang on. Are we gonna be ba We are gonna be bouncing off those, aren't we? We're gonna be bouncing off the flans. I've never had flan. Uh, so the question is, where do I want to go? Is it gonna make me bounce all the way to the other side? I assume so? I bet it is, isn't it? Uh, is there anything over there? I don't think so. Although we could then go across to that one, and that's how I would get to the door, I think. But where would that one take me? Is there a chest over there? Nah, it's basically, I think both ways go the same. Same way, I think. Let's give it a go. Doing. Okay, yep, this is the best dungeon so far. Yep. Yep. I love it. I love it. This is so great. <laughs> oh. That's fantastic. Flantastic. Oh, that's probably the name of the video. Ba -da -da -da. Right, where are we going now? Still a ways to go. So that's going to take us to the third floor. Let's see what's up this way first. Oh, hello. God, they go so quick. They go so quick in speed up mode. We got blood bonnets and goo bonds. Uh, they're kind of the inverted versions of each other. I like it. I don't know which one to try and scout, though. I suppose it doesn't really matter. Oh, angry straight away. Okay. Are they just physical attackers? Oh no, they can they can put you to sleep. Which again is why those rousing rings are so good. Oh, I'll tell you what, this team, dude, this team. No levels. No levels. That's so sad. Uh, oh god, there are so there are too many enemies in this dungeon, though. I gotta say, too goddamn many. A little stage there, that's cute. Any chests behind here? Nope. Uh, oh god, damn it! Oh, I just randomly decided to try scouting the flying saucer, and I got it. There we go. Uh, you're a rank C. Uh, you were quite easy to scout, I'm surprised. That's alright, though. I wonder what the total, uh, like, percentage of monsters I've caught is. Also. Oh. That's going down. Is that a shortcut? Is this a shortcut? I mean, we can bounce on that one and get across there. And then across... Oh, there's a switch. There's a switch. Yeah, this is a completely different room. I've just realized this isn't the main room. Uh, right, well, let's climb down here and just see if there is anything. Uh, I thought I did see... Yeah, there's something here. Is it... I, I'd love some... 
Okay, a pretty pebble. I, I would like some pinballs, really, but... Uh, okay. Let's go see what this switch does, then. So this looks like this place is actually a little bit more complicated than I actually thought. <laughs> is this just going to make the flan get bigger? I think it is. Oh my god! <laughs> it doesn't make the flan bigger, it just jumps, <laughs> dumps a bigger flan on top of the flan. And now we can get up here. Okay. This is wonderful. This is wonderful. Uh. Oh, hang on. Ah. So if I jump this way now. Oh, no, we're not quite. Not quite. Okay. Uh, so I think I just have to go... Huh. I'm not actually sure. Do I just go back the way I came? Because I can't get across there. And there's no platform... Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, no, no. No, I got it. I think I got it. I think I got it, guys. I think I got it. That is wild. Although, saying that, how do I actually get down to the ground floor? Yeah, I, I okay. Yep. Yeah, no, I I got this. I got this. I've figured it out. I've figured it out. There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Uh, then I jump across here. And I got the ladder. Oh, actually, no, 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 no. Then I go this way. There we go. I'm a genius. I'm a master of flan. Could say that was the master flan for getting through this this dungeon. <laughs> uh, why am I jumping on the tables? Don't really know. Just feels right. Just feels like I should. And I have missed a staircase. I've kind of ah, uh, I've kind of ignored a staircase. Maybe I should have gone up it just to see what there was. Uh, again, we'll try and scout one of these guys. One of, one of you wants to join me, right? Come on. There's tons of other monsters that have done it. They, 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 I've got great reviews. I mean, I have had some of them die. But, you know, that's because they were weak. <sighs> Fine. Just, just be gone. Be gone with you. I have no time for this. Thanks for the XP, though, buddies. Mr. Pigney, the level 60, bloody one. Yeah, so I have probably skipped out on a chunk of this dungeon, I hope. I mean, we could always backtrack if I need to. But we'll just, uh, we'll press on. You know what would have been funny? You know what would have been cool? If, uh, if instead of these these being floors, right? Second floor, third floor. Should have really been layers, shouldn't it? Because it's a cake. Would have been better if it was like layer one, layer two. Now, the localization, pretty good with Dragon Quest. Like, one of the best in anything ever. But uh, just a little pointer, you know, just from, just from me to you, Square. Um, if you want to wanna take that, you know. If you, if you want me to write, help write. On, on the next Dragon Quest, I would, I would be up for that. I would totally do it. Uh, this is... Okay. 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 So... We must have to... Yeah, there's switches around the place as well. Oh, this is gonna take me a while, isn't it? This is gonna take me... A while. Right, hang on. There was another way I could have gone a second. Could have gone this way. Let me dodge not yet, just for some pots. I mean, hopefully it'll be worth it. Please be a mini medal. 
Okay, I'll take an elephant, an elephant elixir and a mini medulla ride. Now I definitely think we have enough for a reward. How did I dodge them? How did I dodge three of them? I have no idea. I'm just that good. Bum 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 bum. Right. Now the problem is I am gonna probably have to I said probably twice. Gonna have to end the video midway through this dungeon, and that just means I'm gonna be so confused when I come back. But if I can end off at a place where it's obvious what I need to do next is then that's fine, isn't it? Uh well for one thing, I'm pretty sure I have to press this switch. This is a fun dungeon, though. I love that. So, now... They've even got little notice boards up. Look, they've got even... That's so cute. Right, we need the other one across there to be turned on now. Uh, I don't know if we're going to reach it, though. Because... Oh, we did! We bloody did! Nice! Alright, that's two of four. There's the low battery. I knew it was coming. I knew it was coming. Okay. Okay. Well, chaps, then I think we will end it here. Next time, hopefully, I'll be able to figure out the rest of this dungeon. It, uh, it doesn't seem too bad so far. Uh, so we're going to end off here, chaps, and I will see you next time for some more Dragon Quest. Take care, everyone. Bye-bye for now.